everyone, the Pony Ghost Wolf here, and today I'll be reacting a Gravity Falls animatic. This is called Ford's Sweater, and I'm gonna react to this video and tell you my reactions. Uh, I have no idea what's going going on in this. It's like a this guy's gonna explain new short. So let's do this. By the way, I'm not trying to copyright or anything. The original video can be found on YouTube. So yeah, you can just see Ford's Weather. You can just find it right here on this channel. I just showed it. So yeah, if you mixed it, sorry. Now let's get started. Welcome back to Duper's Guide to the Unexplained, number 67. Ford's of course, Sweater. this will happen. <laughs> it's the middle of summer, the hottest time of the year, and our great uncle Ford has never taken off his sweater, not once. I wear sweaters all the time. You don't sleep with them wear the exact same one every day. I How do you know Uncle too. Fort doesn't just have 30 red identical sweaters? Hmm. The fact that he's never taken off leads me to believe that he's hiding something. But what, what could it be? Heck is I've come up with several theories of what's underneath that sweater. <laughs> Each of which have been generously illustrated by the world famous Crazy Amazing. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. If there's one thing I've learned in Gravity Falls, Wait. it's that anything. Anything oh. is possible. Where you smell? As such, we put together a compilation. Oh my goodness, how many do you have? 633. 633. Wait a minute, do they have to be like, um, 12? Great Uncle Ford's sweater. Or something? It could be something as simple as a tattoo. Like Grand Uncle Sam's. It could be a scar. From fighting space aliens. It could be both a tattoo <laughs> and a scar. <laughs> or just a <laughs> I mean, well, there's no such thing as a top. Maybe he's got another face. <laughs> extra set of limbs. <laughs> Maybe he got infected with an alien. Yeah, yeah, by the way, you just are normal. I wonder if he ever trained with Manitors. Manitors. A swarm with mermaids. Or merman. Or the mango. Or maybe he just has a giant eye for a stomach. Like Bill has an eye for a face. What the or heck is that even? You get where we're going with this. It's kinda yeah. weird. That's literal steel. What is this? What is this? This, oh, this okay. is weird. Do you a universe? Well, that's all for Dippers Guide to the Annex. Oh, then. Oh, no. Four okay. Four stencils of his time in the basement, so it's hard to get solid evidence. But he can stay in there forever. <laughs> ah! What the heck is that doing? It's kinda creepy. You'll get used to it. Keep it this guy was so weird. Like seriously, the the voices are very good chosen, but like the voices are very creepy. Like, like the scene where Dipper made will laugh is kind of creepy. If this was actual short, it could scare tons of kids. This was my reaction, and I think this is a very good animatic. Uh, credit to the person who made this. Uh, I'm kind of surprised to see Dip Evil Dipper and Mabel in this because this was very shocking to see. But at least you saw it, guys. So I'm sorry if I jump scared you or something. So yeah. And also a new episode of Circus Cruise Post will be out soon. And of course a new sort on my regular show, um, Hello Governor. I changed it to uh, Redmus because I didn't find the original Governor picture. So yeah, thanks for watching guys. Subscribe to my channel and goodbye.